Hanson Dam front nine hole vlog. Subscribe if you like these videos because I'm going all in on YouTube. New videos every single week. This is a playing video, but I got some teaching videos coming very, very soon. Boom, smack this 310 down the middle. But this video is not about my ball striking, which has been very consistent lately. This video is about me trying not to three putt because I've been dealing with the yips for like six or seven months, also known as focal dystonia, which means there is a fucked up connection between some of the nerves in your hand and in your brain. But uh, yeah, I'm out here trying to fix it. I'm going to leave my score up at the top left so you can follow along. Second hole, par five. Smacked it again. Again, ball striking, not my problem right now. It's all the putting. Nice shot. If you follow my Instagram, you would know that I was here just a couple days ago and my putting was sus. Super questionable. I uh, went back to a putter that I have been using for a while. So it's a new old putter. I know it doesn't make sense, but I got a new old putter. I'm going back to a super wide stance. Let's see if that makes a difference. Uh, I'm gonna try to not three putt today. So hole one, 21 feet, success. Not a three putt, no three wiggles. We're running it back. Let's do it. You gotta love blind confidence from a man who's about to three putt in the next 10 minutes. But uh, yeah, that's me. Second shot approach here into this par five, slinging a seven iron in there. <laughs> it just got caught up. One more yard and it would have gone on. It got caught. So now I have this little baby chip. Kind of hits the fringe in like hydroplanes, but works out for me. <laughs> I see you. Even I could make Heard that putt. I switched back to this Titleist driver with a hazardous Hulk shaft. And it sucks. I suck with it. So yeah, getting rid of this club for right. It's a fucking tree. Comes down super lucky. Little chippy eight iron here that I just, I left the face open. Squirts right. I'm on the green, but like, yeah, not good. I know, not good. I'm like a bazillion miles away. And uh, yeah, that, that confident man who said he's not going to three putt today. Guess what? That man was fucking wrong, sir. Oh my God, low side. Never even really gave it a chance. Uh, that is definitely not what I wanted. Uh, I think it was less than 10 minutes ago that I said, no three putts today and immediately three putted. Part of three putting is I gotta hit it closer. The other part is I have to be more fucking confident, dude. I'm like, I knew that wasn't gonna go in. <laughs> so it didn't, but the plan for the rest of the day is to say to myself before I actually hit the putt, this is going in. So that's my mantra for the rest of the day. This is going in. I actually feel like I have fixed my putting since this video. Oh, by the way, yeah, left the face wide open. Not the club twirl you want to see on a long uphill par three. Long uphill bunker shot, but no worries. I got that covered. I want to shout out one of my followers who pointed out to me exactly what I was doing wrong. The advice just came a little too late for this putt. So a wide stance in a massive decel. I'm just the takeaway is too fast and I'm deselling. So here I go tapping in for bogey, going to one over hit this drive. Well, a little off the toe. I'm still going to throw in a club twirl. Yeah. Just like baby twirl for the mid drive, cut the corner though. Perfectly. So I'm in good position here. Uphill 123 plan, like 125, 126 full 56 degree for your boy club twirl again. Put it close and I was not leaving this short. It was a way better stroke. So I'm going back to like a narrow stance. I don't think the wide stance was it. I'm gonna get away from that. Back to even with that bounce back bird. Got a long par five here, 567. Can't go right. And it starts way right, way too far right. This is just not the right driver for me. Look at me begging it to come back left. Okay, I'll take it. And another diesel off the deck this time. Dude, I literally hit this way too perfect. Like, way, way too good. Oh, my God. Hit that fucking DOD further than the actual drive. Went through the green. Apologize to the people in front. That's my bad. Definitely hit up on them. That's that's my bad. That's my bad. Chip this almost in. So, tap in, bird. Not going to three putt from a foot away. Downhill par three. A little bit into the wind. And I hit a slinger i actually did think it had a chance sort of landed on the front of the green rolled out 
towards the hole. I mean, I have bad depth perception, but it looked like it was rolling right to the cup. I'm really playing those sweeping draws today. Look, just play the shot shape. <laughs> Don't fight it. Back to the narrow stance. I think I think narrow is better for me. It gets me a little taller, more over the putt. This was the best stroke. This was the best stroke that I had made yet. It was because I really, really slowed down the takeaway of the club. So if you're struggling like I was, slow down your putter takeaway. Great example of how feel is not real. That's definitely not what my actual swing looks like. But to me, that's what I wanted to feel to hit a cut. My stealth goes so much fucking farther than this club. I mean, that that was a good shot, but yeah, back to the OG stealth for me. About 100 yards, front flag, little thin, landed like right next to the flag, but that is not going to stop, sir. Uh, maybe. Was I nervous over this 50-footer? Yes. Fuck yes, I was. Was I even more nervous when I watched it go like nine feet by the hole? Yeah. That really goes out must make for the confidence oh my god was i relieved to see that go in worst drive of the day for number nine which is the hardest par four but we're gonna deal with it yep that is right for ride. chipping out a five iron here trying to get it through these trees clips a branch does not get all the way through so now i got like 50 yards just a little chunky, exactly how my wife describes me to her friends. Anyways, tap that down. Got to make this for par and a minus one front nine. Back to the narrow stance, though, and a good roll. I don't care that I didn't make it. I feel like I'm fixing my putting. Thank you guys so much. Leave below your best putting advice and subscribe for more videos like this.